Hi everybody. Here's my gripe with grips. Now, to start off, I really want to say that I do love grips. I truly do. If you grab a bunch of stuff, grab a grip, hit the space bar, you're now moving it, hit the space bar, you're rotating it, hit the space bar, you're scaling it, hit the space bar, you're, you're mirroring it. I do love grips. What I don't like is the new menus that come with the multifunction grips. And here's my issue. If I come in here and I grab a bunch of things and my mouse happens to end up on top of a grip, I get a menu. Now, th these tools I love. I love to be able to stretch the vertex, add a vertex, remove a vertex. I'm not complaining about the tools. What I don't like is the menu because I'm a keyboard junkie. I love to type everything that I possibly can. So if I come in here and I hit E space, nothing happens because it's trying to find the hotkey in this menu that starts with E. Now, if I come in here and I actually type out the whole erase command, E R U R, it removes the vertex. So I'm trying to erase the whole thing, and all it does is remove a vertex. That's not what I want. So what do I do? Well, I go into my options. Under the Selection tab, I toggle off the Show Dynamic Grip menu. So now when I come in here and I mouse over this, you can see my mouse is over the top of the grip, but I don't get the menu. So if I type E space here, it erases them just like I wanted. Now, how do I go ahead and get into all those grips? I want to put a curve on this line. Well, if I mouse over it, there's no menu. But if I grab it, I'm now stretching it. And if I hit my control key, it cycles me through all those different options. The first option is stretch, so it really didn't do anything. You hit control again. I'm now adding a vertex. Hit control again. I'm converting it to an arc, hit control again, I'm back to stretching it. So this is what I use instead of using the menus. I hope this is something that you might be able to find helpful. Thanks for watching.